What's going on YouTube? Today's video is going to be on full table position play. To set up this drill, we have the cue ball placed on the first diamond on the long rail and the second diamond on the short rail. The one ball will be one ball's width away from the pocket and then your two ball will be set up as so. You have the half ball on the second diamond on the long rail and your number three ball is going to be on the first diamond on the short rail, also half, half ball's width. And then your four is gonna be also a half ball's width on the third diamond on the short rail. Then you have your number five is gonna be on the second diamond on the long rail and also about half, half ball's width. This is where it's different. This is this number six. It's gonna be half a diamond on the short rail and the third diamond on the long rail, opposite side of the cue ball and the one ball. And the seven ball is on the opposite side. It's also half a diamond away on the short rail and the third diamond on the long rail. To gain position on the two ball, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit the cue ball with a stun draw and hit the one ball about a half ball hit and going to this rail and hopefully landing around here to get position on the two ball. To get position on the three ball, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit the cue ball with stun and a half ball hit on the one, going from one rail to two rails and hopefully get position around here for your three ball. To get to the four, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit the cue ball with top right, a quarter ball hit on the one, going one rail, two rails, and hopefully land over here for the four itself. To get to the five, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit the cue ball with just top and a quarter ball hit on the one, going one rail and controlling the speed and hopefully land around here for your five ball. To get position on the six, Hit the cue ball with just top, a core ball hit on the one, going one rail, two rails, and hopefully land around here to get position on your six. To get on seven, you're gonna hit the cue ball with just stun, no spin, with a half ball hit on the one, going one rail, controlling the speed, and hopefully landing over here for the seven. For the second drill, this time you're going to have the cue ball on the second diamond on the long rail and the second diamond on the short rail. And the one is also in the same location as before. It's still a one ball's width away from the pocket. And the balls itself, for the object ball, is also located at the same figure as last time before. To get on the two ball, what you're going to do, you're going to hit the cue ball with just top, a quarter ball hit on the one, going one rail, and controlling your speed, and hopefully land over here for your position on the two.
To get position on the three ball, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit with a stun draw, a half ball hit on the one, going one rail, two rails, and landing over here for your three ball. To get to the four, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit the cue ball with just top itself, a quarter ball hit going one rail and controlling the speed and hopefully land around here for your four ball. To get on the five, you're gonna hit the cue ball with low left, a half ball hit on the one, going one rail, and then hopefully landing around here for your position on the five. To get on the six ball, what you're going to do, you're going to draw the cue ball itself, hitting the one ball full, and hopefully controlling your draw shot and landing around here for the six ball. To get on the seven, what you're gonna do, you're gonna hit the cue ball with just top, a quarter ball hit on the one, going one rail, controlling the speed, and hopefully landing around here for your seven. I just did some of the basic position play where the one ball was close to the corner pocket and the object balls are on the opposite side of the table. Well, hopefully this video was informative. Stay tuned, my next video will be getting on the correct line of the object ball. And thank you for watching. See you next time. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe me. Don't forget the thumbs up. Bye bye.